Welcome back to another episode of Seattle Franchise Mode with your boy, King of Chow. Okay, so we're on the fourth game facing Winnipeg. So what I'm going to do first is I've switched the camera angle. Let me know if uh, today's camera angle is better than the previous ones or whether the previous angles are better. So the first thing for today is let's take a look at the stats of the playoffs. So Matthew Hughes doing really well, Dougie too, Gibson, Bluin, Keller, Dubois. Dubois is not that not doing that great. My minus three, but that's okay. He has two points in three games. Kel McCarr, that's good. Joy Erickson Eck, he's a fourth liner, so yes, yeah, true well, yeah, okay. Landis Gog not doing well. Kako not doing that well. Newendike, Halistruck. Yeah, the first line has not been doing well. I don't want to make a change yet, just because it's only been three games. But look at this. Connor Hellebuck, 921 save percentage, one shutout, 1.67 GAA. That's what we like to see. Okay, so the next thing that we're going to do is check out the AHL. So we're also leading this series 2-1. And the stats are right now that uh, Ty Raddy is doing well, 5 points. Olofsson, 4 points. Ed Engel, Walker, um, random guy, Joe Morrow, Steenbergen, Dalko, Lindborg. Banks is not doing well. Um, that's surprising. 33 minutes of ice time, 1 point. That's okay. We're going to let it roll. AHR, I normally change nothing. Just because. Um, AHR doesn't matter as much as NHL. But let's hop into the fourth game. We're away for this game. And we are... Gonna look to do better in the first period. See, recently we haven't been doing well in the first period. We've been terrific in the second and third. Okay, here we go. Dubois on the draw. Loses it. Not a good start, but that's okay. Huge pickoff. Loses a puck though. On the car on D. That's okay. Weak shot. Jamie Newendike. Gonna do the windmill. Oh! Good try. To the point. Um, okay. Big hit. Okay, yeah, fair enough. Um, I stretch out a bit, and that's a power play for them. Definitely not what I would have liked early in the first period, but that's okay. Our penalty kill has been surprisingly strong. Um, but, like, honestly, I'm happy with our penalty kill. It's been really good as of late. Oh my goodness, Dougie Hamilton, what a player, snipes it up, up top, shorthanded goal again, we've been nailing it for shorthanded goals, but would you look at this shot right away, slap shot, sees the opening, top right corner, drills it. And that's why, Pittsburgh, you don't trade an aging veteran. As for playoff runs, oh yeah, you best believe. Okay. 
I love Buck making some big saves as usual. New and Dyke. Oh my! Okay. This is gonna be one of those games, aren't it? Team Rally, listen. Two short handed goals on the same power play. Boys have really started well. I don't know what they ate for breakfast today, but oh boy, am I loving it. Okay, Kel McCarr. Yeah, like the boys have really woken up. This was not what I was expecting. Oh my baby. Okay, it's 3 nothing. It's a first period. We're gonna only play the first period if we score another goal. This game is getting out of hand. We're just hitting the post and in. No chance for Nielsen. Um, this is just a showcase by Seattle. Man. I mean, I'm not gonna complain. I think EA knows how much I screwed me over last game. I mean, the game before that, rather. So they're forget they're making up for it by making me easily win last game and on pace to easily win this game. To the point where I'm considering to sim it. Oh! Okay. Okay, what is... Okay. You know what? I feel bad for Winnipeg. They're just getting onslaught. Dougie Hamilton, two goals tonight. First period. This one was a lucky bounce. Um, off the defenseman. That is just... Winnipeg, sorry guys. Today is not your day. Look at this. Okay, the shot. And through the guy. Here, I'll get, I'll get you guys an even better look at it. Six shots, four goals. How are they not pulling their goalie yet? Okay. So here we go. Capo Caco to Dougie Hamilton. Um, and then... And then basically... Look at that. Here, hold on. Let me... Um... Try and zoom. Um, so this player, it went through the stick, okay, and then it went through the goalie, um, here, sorry, okay, off the player, Off the player, right over here, off the player skates, and it goes in. That's a, that's just unfortunate. Uh, they, I think they've switched the, their goalie now. Their home crowd is silenced. Oh my goodness. Okay. When it pours, it rains, bellows. When it rains, it pours. This is a monsoon. Your vis blue with the pod goalie, first shot he faces, a one-timer. This game is over. I mean, seven shots, five goals. We've scored on pretty much every shot. Three hits. Time on attack, we're only beating them by seven. Four face-offs, one. Two penalty minutes, two short-handed goals. And I don't know what to tell you. Uh, actually, I do know what to tell you. The game's over. 
Five nothing. What a first period. That's probably the best first period I've ever had. Uh, I mean, most of it eight two. We obliterated them. Dougie Hamilton went off. Absolutely off. Just, just off. Like that is, that is just too good, right there. I don't know what the boys ate for breakfast, but if we get a first period like that again, consider yourselves to be out, Winnipeg. Um, yeah. Second game here now. I must say that that game was probably the lopsided most lopsided game I've personally played since I used to play on semi-pro when I used to obliterate every team 11-0. That is just... Boys went off, and now we're in front of the home crowd. Let's finish in front of the home crowd. Okay. I mean, I expect Winnipeg to fire, because that loss was... Embarrassing for them. So I won't be surprised if we lose this game. But I think with the boys so motivated, so much motivation, I think we'll still win. I mean, but I expect it to be a close game. Line A trying to take a shot. Good block, Kel McCarr. See, this is the thing I love about Kel McCart. He's so fast. Oh. We scored, but they're calling it off. Oh, my goodness. Jamie Neuendijk, why did you go right to the net? They're calling goalie interference. This is not goalie interference. The goal was already in, and the goalie was in position to save that. But that's okay. Um, I mean... We're just on fire lately, so I think we'll still beat them easily. Mondeslav loses it. Keller. Bit of a four, four check going on. Oh, that was a good poke check. Good play. Playing Keller. On D. Okay, block that. Nice. Good block. Jacob Truba. Okay, Capo Caco. Windmill, not quite. Doesn't work. Point shot deflected and a wide open net for the rebound. Gabriel Landeskog. That is what we like to see. I think we're gonna win this series 4-1. The boys want to win the cup. Dougie Hamilton with another assist. I mean, he's just on fire. No one can stop Dougie Hamilton. That's what you call a trade deadline pickup. Oh, bad pass. But that's okay. Hughes. Skoskis. Victor Mede. Fast bomb gets it. That's okay. Um, okay, this isn't good positioning. And they pin us. They're going to keep it in the zone. And like I said, Winnipeg's hungry. They're hungry. But... Do I think they'll beat the boys? Probably not. I was trying to do the same thing I did in the first period last game. Walk in, backhand, forehand, uh, and try and go top shelf. But as you can see, it's not actually that effective. I mean, I don't know what happened last game, but... Like, it's not that... It's not as effective. It is pretty effective, but it's not as effective.